Hello students, I am Pratima. Welcome you all to this video again. Today we will discuss some questions based on the property of the triangle. The exterior angle of a triangle is equal to sum of two interior opposite angles. So here I have taken some questions based on this concept from R.S. Agarwal book meant for class 7 exercise 15 B. So let us begin. This is a triangle A angle A angle B angle C are there. Now if we produce side BC then the angle ACD will be the exterior angle and this will be equal to angle A and angle B because they are the interior opposite angles for angle ACD. Similarly, if we produce side CA, angle BAE is the exterior angle and it will be sum of two interior angles that is B plus C. In the same way, we will produce AB up to F. A, B, B, F, B, C is the exterior angle and it will be sum of A and C. Because for this, A and C will be interior opposite angles. So with this concept, let us begin the questions. First question. In this figure, given alongside the major of Angle A, C, D, you have to find out. Angle A, C, D. So figure is also given. So no need of drawing. You can find this angle is your angle A, C, D. So this is your exterior angle. So exterior angle. And these two are interior opposite angles. So take the sum. So angle A, C, D is equal to 75 plus 45. How much this? It will be 120 degree. Question number two. In the figure given alongside, find the values of x and y. You have to find the value of x and y. So it is also simple. You can take both the property of the triangle you can take the sum of angles of a triangle is 180 degree. You can take the properties of your linear pair. You can do so by so many methods. So I am doing by first using exterior angle like so. So exterior angle is ACD is equal to your ABC angle plus BAC. This will be how much it is given? 130 degree it is given. So what is ABC? 68 degree plus X is equal to 130 degree. So can you get X? So X is equal to 130 minus 68. So it will be 262 degree. So you can check once whether it is correct or not. Yes, it is correct. Then for getting Y, you can get, you can take two methods. First, we can use angle Y and 130 are linear pair. So Y plus 130 is equal to always 180 degree. Why? What is the logic? They are linear pair on the same line. So Y will be simple 180 minus 130 degree. It will be 50 degree. So now instead of this you can also get x plus 68 plus y is equal to 180 degree taking the sum of the triangle property 
you can get in that way also question number three in this figure given alongside find the values of x and y so it is simple how to get x you can Use exterior angle concept. Exterior angle is which one? Exterior angle is angle ACD. That is 65 degree. And what are the two interior angles? One is X. One is 32. So X plus 32 degree is equal to 65 degree. So how much is X? X is equal to 65 minus 32. So it will be 3, 3, 33 degree. So x is equal to 33 degree. And for y, you can take the linear pair exam. y plus 65 is equal to 180 degree. And y is equal to 180 degree minus 65. So how much it will be? Is it 115 degree? Yes, you can check it once. Question number four. Question number four, the exterior angle of a triangle is 110 degree. It's interior opposite angles and ratio two is to three. This ray, this are in ratio angle A and angle B are in ratio two is to three. You have to find the angles. Find A and B. Angle A ratio angle B is equal to 2, 3. And what is the sum of A plus B? It is 180, 110 degree. Sum of angle A plus B is equal to 110 degree. Because that is the exterior angle. Now when ratios are given, we can take late angle A, B, twice X and angle B is equal to three times of X. So now it's simple. Sum of these two, two X plus three X is equal to 110 degree or 5 times of x is equal to 110 degree or x is equal to 110 division 5. This is 22 degree. So after getting x, you can get 2x, 2 times of x equal to 2 multiplying 22, it will be 44 degree and you can get 3 times of x, it will be 2 into 3 into 22, it will be 66 degree. So what are the angles? A is, or two angles are, you can write, two angles are, is equal to, your 44, and will be is 66 degree. Question number 5. An exterior angle of a triangle is 108 degree. The interior opposite angles are equal to each other. Find the measure of each angle of a triangle. The exterior angle is equal to your 110 degree. Is it 110? No, it is 100 degree. And these two are equal. Interior opposite angles. One interior opposite is A. One is, is B. So let them be X and X. Now it is simple. So let the equal interior opposite angles be X and X. Then sum of two interior angle, opposite angles is equal to your exterior angle. So how much it will be? 
it will be 100 degree so can you get now yes you can get it so 2 times of ax is equal to 100 degree or x is equal to 100 degree divided by 2 that is 50 degree so measure of each angle of triangle is 50 degree 50 degree and I wrote out the third angle third angle will be 180 minus 100 that will be 80 degree so and 80 degree question number six in this figure alongside angle a c d angle a e d you have to find angle a c d and you have to find angle a e d a e d okay so take first we can take your a b c why in triangle a b c ACD is the exterior angle. Isn't it? Yes. So, I'll write A angle A, C, D. Angle A, C, D is, is exterior of angle of triangle ABC. So, SED is equal to sum of 25 degree and 45 degree. How much it will be? 70 degree. So, I got this angle as 70 degree. Now, for AED, for AED, for AED angle, I will take this triangle. ECD. In triangle E C D A E D is exterior angle. Making slide please. So A E D is equal to how much? Seventy. Seventy. AED is equal to 70 plus 40. So 70 degree and 40 degree are interior opposite angles. So how much it will be? It will be 110 degree. So AED is 110 degree. Question number 7. In this figure alongside, you have to find ACD. ACD, where is ACD? You have to find ACD then you have to find ADC ADC this angle ADC then you have to find DAE you have to find this DAE okay can you think of yes we can think of first I am taking the triangle a B C just see A B C here the sum of triangles is 180 degree so angle A plus angle B plus angle C is equal to 180 degree in which triangle in triangle A B C A is not given B is given 40 C is given 100 is equal to 180 degree. So can I get angle A? Can get angle A is equal to 180 minus the sum is 140. So it will be 40 degree. So angle A is equal to 40 degree. Angle A is 40 degree. Next, next after getting this 40 degree, now I can get ACD. Why? 
ACD is the exterior angle of ACB. So it will be just 40 plus 40. In triangle ABC, ACD is the exterior angle. So angle ACD is equal to 40 plus 40 sum of two interior opposite angles. This will be 80 degree. So angle ACD is now here 80 degree. This is 80 degree. And I think this is 80 degree. After getting 80 degree ACD, so ACD we got 80 degree. Now coming to ADC. ADC to get, I'll take the property of the triangle. Some angle A plus angle A plus angle C plus angle D is equal to 180 degree. So I'll write in triangle ACD angle A plus angle C plus angle D is equal to 180 degree. So how much will be D? I can take the sum of 50 and 80. It will be 130. So angle D is equal to 180 minus 130. It will be 50 degree. So I got angle D is equal to how much? 50 degree. This angle is 50 degree. 50 degree. So angle ACD is equal to 50 degree. Then coming to DAE. DAE. How to get DAE? Think of DAE. How to get DAE? DAE either you can use your linear pair. This total sum is 90 degree, 180 degree. Or you can take your Extra angle concept also, but I am taking the linear pair itself. 40 plus 50 plus DAE is equal to 180 degree. 40 degree plus 50 degree plus DAE is equal to 180 degree. Why? Linear pair. That means this is not pair. On a straight line, the sum of all angles gives you 180 degree. So this gives you 90 degree. So angle TAE is equal to 180 minus 90. It will be 90 degree. So angle TAE is 90 degree. Question number 8. Question number 8 is, in this figure, x is to y is equal to 2 is to 3. Angle ACD is equal to 130. Find x, y, z. So here, we have produced this. So ACD is equal to 130 degree. You can see the figure. And x is to y is equal to 2 is to 3. So I'll take x as 2 times of k. k is a multiple. y is equal to 3 times of k. And we know that x plus y is equal to 130 degree. So 2 times of k plus 3 times of k is equal to 130 degree. Or 5 times of k is equal to 2 plus k. 2k plus 3k is 5 times of k is equal to 130. Or k is equal to 130 division 5. It is 26 degree. So how much will be 2k? x is equal to 2k. So it will be 2 into 26. That will be 52. And y is equal to 3 times of k, that will be 
3 into 26, it will be 70. 3, 6, 18 carries 1, 78. So x is how much? It is your 52 degree. Y is how much? It will be 78 degree. And next coming to Z. For Z, I'll apply your linear pair example. Z plus 130 is equal to 180 degree. Y linear pair. So how much is Z? Z is equal to 180 minus 30 is equal to 130 minus 50 degrees. So what is x? x is 20, 52 degree. What is y? y is equal to 78 degree. What is z? z is equal to 50 degree. I hope you have enjoyed. You I hope you learnt a lot so please subscribe the channel